welcome and good morning in today's class we will see working of diode diode in dc diode diode is a diode is a <laughs> diode is a semiconductor it conducts in forward bias and it will not it will not conduct in and it will not conduct in reverse and it will not conduct in forward bias now let us see what is forward bias and what is reverse bias when when anode of diode is more is more positive than If anode of diode is more positive than cathode, then the diode is said to be in forward bias. If if cathode is more positive than anode, then the diode is said to be in reverse bias now let us verify this statement that means in forward bias it will conduct and reverse bias it will not conduct right now let us verify this statement by similarity Now let us go and get the components from library browser. Go to library browser. First we will see what is the behavior of a diode when it is connected to a DC source. Add a DC source and your diode is present in power electronics library. In power electronics library you are having diode. The next thing we need is the resistor current measurement, voltage measurement and scope. First we will have the first we will space the DCs source then current measurement then 
diode. You can see that it is having two terminals. A is anode, K is cathode. It is a two terminal semiconductor device. Positive terminal is called as anode, negative terminal is called as cathode. Now, the input output of current DC source is connected to input of current measurement. Output of current measurement is connected to anode. The cathode is connected to the load. Other end of the load is connected to a DC source. And let me change the R value as. Now, let us connect the voltage source across your resistor. Next, it is having two waveforms and hence we have to change number of inputs to two. current and voltage. The last thing we need to add is power guy. Go to simulation library and add power guy. Now let us simulate it. Here the volt the current is. Now let us split the waveform into two. Now let us separate the voltage waveform and current waveform. The voltage is zero because source because the R value was low and hence the voltage was also low. No. That is the first waveform is your current waveform, the second waveform is your voltage waveform. Again, you can get those details by going to display and enabling Legrand. Go to second display and enable your Legrand. Now, this is current measurement and this is voltage. Now, you can see that the current it flows from source to the low. That means when anode is more positive than cathode. Here anode is connected to positive and cathode is connected to negative. Anode is more positive than cathode. Now this diode is said to be in forward bias and it will act as a wire. It will act as a wire. Now let us go and change, check the behavior of diode for a reverse bias condition. The condition for reverse bias is cathode is more positive than anode. That means cathode is connected to ne negative positive and anode is connected to negative. And now let us disconnect the circuit and change. The other way of doing it is I can flip the Now cathode is connected to positive and anode is connected to negative. Now let us see what is our waveform. Now you can see that the both voltage and current across the load is zero. That means it act as an open switch. Now it act as an open circuit. In reverse bias condition diode will not conduct in reverse bias condition diode will not conduct but in forward bias condition the diode will conduct again you can see that 
the output voltage and current is zero. Now let us again. And you are saying because it is you are saying that it is in reverse bias condition by this term. Cathode is connected to positive and anode is connected to negative. By this way, we are saying that the diode is in reverse bias condition. Now let us again change. Now cathode is connected to positive, sorry, anode is connected to positive and cathode is negative connected to negative. Now let us simulate the circuit and let us see the output. Now you can see that voltage is 99.9 and current is also 99.9. In forward bias it acts as a switch, it is an automatic switch. In forward bias it will act as a wire and in reverse bias it will act as an open circuit. This is the response of a diode for a DC input. Thank you.